<sighs> I'll explain it again real slow. I want to broadcast your subconscious into the Decker Usernet. Then you'll be able to interact with the avatars of users and corrupt the abstract representations of data that are the cornerstone of their online operation. To do that, I need... A Nemo chair, of course. A what chair? Nemo, neurological electromagnetic on gyroscope. The KGB destroyed the only one in existence. The Deckers have one. Impossible. How could they miss the signal? They're keeping it here. Clever. Okay, nerd time is over. What is this thing? And Kinsey, for fuck's sake, keep it simple. <sighs> I need the chair to stop the Deckers. Thank you. Once we get to the nuclear plant, I'll need to cut the external power uplinks to the main building. Why don't we just run in and take the chair? Well, we could if you want all its circuitry to fry as we try to disconnect it from the power grid. I'm guessing that would be a bad thing? Yeah. So if you're looking me up to this thing, it's gonna be comfortable, right? How should I know? It's a chair. Yeah, but are we talking padded leather that reclines or some wicker bullshit? That's what you're worried about? If your ass is gonna be comfy? These details are important! How about some music? No thanks. Come on. Some techno or dubstep? That's all over the internet, right? Not interested. You don't like easy listening shit, do you? God, no. This is what, 80s rock? Death metal! Hardcore gangster rap. Seriously? This looks like it. Buy me the time to shut down this power node. You got it. That's right! <laughs> I've seen better. Mind keeping it down out there? Are you, you're kidding, right? Sort of. Impressive. How's it going in there? These things take time. Uh, you should just let me shoot it instead. Two down, last one, and we're in business. People just can't fight. Now can we go in and get 
get this chair? Nope. Now we go up in a helicopter. A helicopter? They could be keeping the chair anyway. I have to triangulate. It's that position first while you... I have to protect your ass. Got it. See? We're communicating. Where's it landing? In front of the plant. Just do what, whatever it is you do, and I'll take care of the rest. It's simple. I measure the... Not asking for a lesson here. Right. Forgot. There aren't that many of them. Find anything yet, Kinsey? There's a lot of power output coming from this place, so it's hard to get a lock on the chair. No shit, it's a power plant. I need more time. Let's go get... Just you, and you'll have to take the quick way. The Deckers may already be destroying the chair to keep it from us. Quick way? Yeah, jump. <laughs> I'm in, Kinsey. Cut the chair from their system by disabling the router connection. So press the off button on the consoles. That's what I said, wasn't it? Pierce, you know if that chair thing is ready yet? I don't know. Why ask me? Talk to Kenzie or Oleg. Because you, I can understand. I think they said they'd be done pretty soon. We could probably head over whenever. All right, see you when I get there.
You ready to fuck things up in virtual reality? Safer than being shot at. You can survive a gunshot, but if your mind takes too much shock in this chair, you'll go brain dead. Great plan, Kinsey. I know. You ready? Let's do it. What the hell's going on? He's altering the world to reality there. You'll just have to deal. Too easy. I gotta read this shit? Come on, Kinsey, how do I get out? And ruin it for you? No way, you gotta figure this out on your own. Thanks, Kinsey. I feel like an asshole now. I'm not going to be beaten by some noob you dragged into my world, Kensington. Okay, we're back in business. Now let's take out Matt's antivirus next. <gasps> Kinsey? Why am I at toilet again? But I didn't! I think this is more fitting. Wouldn't you agree? Give me some time, I'll fix it. Hey, still have my cannon. You know who you're fucking with? Is something wrong with the connection? He's bombarding us with data. I'll try blocking it. Kensington, be gone. Okay, the antivirus is almost taken care of. You'll need to destroy the last bit of code. Kenzie, why am I in a tank? Just go with it.
Kinsey? I see it, I see it. I'm gonna enjoy kicking that kid's ass. That's right! I see one more wall ahead. It's his internet security protocol, so blocking access into the main... Yeah, whatever you say. Doesn't know when to quit. Take this out and move up on that himself. You like the face? It's more up for the night late season three, episode five, the Cyprian Order. You just really caught the racist plan for a boy. You modeled this shit off of Nightblade? It's an allegory for man's inhumanity to man. No, it's a shitty vampire show. I don't expect a chuckle fuck like you to appreciate the writing. <laughs> I always win. <laughs> okay, don't panic. We can work this out. Probably. You're not really good at coming. You mean where those giant tubes are feeding into? Ah, that can't be a trap or anything. Must be his direct feed into the world, while his information flows through. Yeah, that's definitely a trap. Again with the comforting skills. <laughs> Easy to laugh when you're hiding like a pussy. Come on out! Glad. You're just a bitch with the keyboard. Ma'am, here you cannot beat me. We'll see about that. Alright, just don't die until I figure out how to copy his avatar. Look at you trying to move. Amusing. Start those dodges early while you're slowed. Oh shit! Kill you one way or another. What are you doing? Get down. Oh, coward. You can't win. You can't win when you don't know which way is up. Your controls are backwards. Careful where you're going. Stop fighting the inevitable. Hope you have your grace stone picked out. Get off me and fight. This is your true self. Small. What? That's impossible! Gods! This is so cool! Looking at the avatar's programming, you should have four main abilities. The sword can be used to slash at things close by, or it can create a giant shockwave. And as a dragon, you have a medium range fire breath and a quick dash to evade hits. Let's test this. That was easy. Thank <laughs> you. 
Fuck me, he's back! You're on even ground now. Should be a piece of cake. That's a real help, Kinsey. Hi, Matt. Wait! I can clear your name. Prove that you didn't destroy that bridge. I'm sure Kenzie can figure it out. I literally have the world at my fingertips. A little vague, Matt. Gotta do better. You tell me the name of a company, and it becomes the property of the Saints. You get your empire back, and I get to walk away. Kid, now we're talking. What are these? They're back doors into company records. One door leads to a weapons manufacturer, giving you discounts on weapon upgrades. And the other? An automotive parts distribution house. They'll discount work done on your cars. Pick one and I'll... I really wish you'd reconsider, Maddie. These hands of mine were meant to rend bone, not hunt and peck on a keyboard. Oh, well, if typing's the issue, I, I can recommend some good voice recognition software. I, I know the best... Shh. You stuck with me when I rose from Philippe's ashes like a phoenix. You and me, we've bonded. Oh, that's lovely, but I feel it's time for me to move on. D to be honest, I'm a little scared of... Well... Dying. I do run a demanding workplace. Maddie, I appreciate how you shared your concerns. I mean, the way Viola and Kiki handled their uh, departures made me just want to kill someone, you know? Oh, absolutely. Well, I've got a flight to catch, so. Maddie. Oh, God. Feel free to list me as a reference anytime. That was stagging time. We need to be careful, Pierce. Uh, oh yeah, I totally agree. Our place might be compromised. Uh-huh, whatever you say. And we should get some horses and mount a charge on stag. All right, I'll get on that. Damn it, Pierce. I'll be over in a bit. Sure. See you soon.
Pack it up, we gotta move. I got 20k on this game. <laughs> Damn! Now it's a draw. This isn't over. What's up? It's not safe here. You guys clear this place out, I'll buy you some time. That should spread them out. I'll start some shit at one of those stack bases. Pierce, how's the pack up going? Slow. We got a lot of shit. Just take what we need. What do you think I'm doing? And Pierce, leave the chessboard. Man, that's cold. Let's see what toys these guys have. Oh! I don't like this either. Mm. Enemy has air support. Startup sequence initiated. How do we hijack the VTOL? Looks like this thing has all their mobile base locations. Pierce, get things moving. I got their attention. We're rolling out in the convoy now. I'll let you know how the streets are looking. with the Saints. Hubbard and the jet boat? Oh, it's like a helicopter that doesn't suck. Woo! Talk to me, Goose! Time to keep the pressure on. Looks like Thag left a roadblock ahead of us. Without help, we ain't getting by. Reinforcements are rolling out. challenge.
Investigate all possible sink vehicles. Courts. You serious? Look, just get there. I'll think of something. I'm Joshua Burke. Hey, on TV I play Nightblade, an exceptionally good-looking but misunderstood vampire who risks life and limb every week to keep the world safe. The men and women of Stag put their lives on the line every day to protect your city against gang violence. Want to be a real-world hero? Talk to your Stag recruiter today. I know I have. Nightblade's the face of Stag. Why don't you just put someone in a fucking deer suit? Hearts and minds will win the war, my dear. Shock and awe wins war, Senator. Authorize the Daedalus, and this will all be over. Absolutely not. That kid's gonna get himself killed. Well, you ensure Josh Brooks' safety, or I'll find someone who can. Understand? Yes, ma'am.